Hi, this is Aaron. Uh, today just wanted to show you the Windows 7 uh, unboxing and see what's in there. Some people wondered if it came with a uh, 64-bit or not. This was the $49 edition or $50 uh, that you got in on about four months or five months ago. Uh, it's the upgrade, but with the upgrade you can install directly to your Windows PC um, and it allows you to install as long as you have a disk from another operating system. So. Uh, Although that's what the past versions did, I understand you can do that with here. I don't know the actual 100% requirements. However, if you're looking for a good deal on multiple PCs, uh, Windows 7, they did something smart this time. Their actual uh, software is only $150 for three licenses, the family pack. So check it out if you need multiple computers. Uh, so here's the box itself. Oh, it's got the, uh, well that's kind of a dumb place to put that, but uh, on top here we've got the Windows uh, sticker, which is actually, does not have the key on it. That made me a little nervous. I thought maybe you guys would have seen that, but it does not have the key on it. It is just a seal. And made in Puerto Rico, apparently, so. Okay, so there are two discs. There's the discs. It does come with. Uh, let's go ahead and pop these off. You've got two discs. Upgrade, 64-bit version over here. You see that? 32-bit here. I apologize for the camera, but just wanted to set this up real quick so you could see. So uh, that's really it. You do get both versions when you buy a copy of Windows. Uh, you've got the upgrading and welcome to your simplified PC and then behind that you have the key and the license um, so that's really it I'm gonna get to installing this and upgrading uh, but you know it's Windows 7 release day I've been running release candidate on one of my PCs for a long time since it came out ran the beta before that uh, it ran really well. Uh, I have to say, at this point, it's a matter of preference. If you like Mac, you go with Mac. If you like Windows, you go with Windows. Uh, Windows 7 has been stable. No problems there. Uh, at least in my experience, it's been by far the best Windows PC, or Windows operating system, rather, uh, up to this point. So uh, be sure to check it out. At least try it out. I know a lot of people that have XP are hesitant. Uh, however, I've used uh, this for such a long time that unless you have something that's XP, or XP specific and you know will not work with uh, 7 for whatever reason, although it should, uh, I don't see a reason not to upgrade at this point. So um, it's more secure. It's definitely pretty snappy. It uh, doesn't seem to crash at all. And I'm notorious for crashing PCs, so I don't really have an issue at this point. But uh, check it out, Windows 7 Home Premium. Uh, like I said, I picked it up for 50 bucks. I don't think they have that deal anymore. Uh, but just to tell you also, if you're a student and you want Windows 7, it's only $29. Just do a search. You have to have an EDU email address. They'll send you uh, the uh, link to the website to sign in with your EDU address and uh, or via email, and uh, you're good to go. You get it for 29 bucks, legit, from Microsoft. So check that out uh, if you have an EDU address and you're a student. Uh, other than that, I'm off to install this. Uh, this is Aaron. We'll see you next time.